<laughs> okay, well, they are home, guys. Our dogs are home. And our humans. <laughs> They're being welcomed by a nice warm crowd. <laughs> a warm, very warm crowd today. <laughs> That's our sponsor dog. <laughs> Thanks for joining us, guys. Our rescue team just arrived back at Lily's Haven with 48 dogs. And I mean feisty all over you. All right, we're gonna welcome everybody. You ready? Here we go. My grandma's Chris. My grandma's Chris. Oh, 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 look at the cutie oh, up there. Hi guys. Oh, 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 I'll take the one. Social distance, everybody, please. Thank you. Thank you guys. Oh, sorry. Oh, oh, oh. 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 This is the little one named Lucille. Lucille. This pup coming out is named Lucille after our wonderful sponsor Wendy's mother. And thank you, Wendy, for sponsoring our rescue. Yes, thank you so much, Wendy. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Just keep a hold of that. Some of them will randomly jump, and if they do, it's uh, All right. All right. I'm going this way. Do you want a picture with your mask off? You got Maybe in a minute. Hey, Pupper. Yeah. Okay. And then if you turn this way, we'll take you'll take him inside. Do you guys unload and pass to people? Is that what it is? Yes, yes. But everyone's kind of waiting and social distancing and all that good stuff, you know? <laughs> Sorry, I will try to stay anyway. <laughs> oh, so cute. Yeah. Hi, Sharon. <laughs> I love long hair dogs and they're so pretty. Yeah, they are. Look at that too. Little old dude. Little old man. Napoleon. Napoleon. What a great name. Hi, Chuck. <laughs> Hi, Glenn. Hi, Alex. Hi, everybody. I match my. I match it. Does it work? For work is that work? Do you wear these to work or a mask? It depends on the color. I've got about 20 different versions of this. Do you coordinate your bow tie with your It's a new pop. It's a very Oh, watch the little leash on the face. Can you move the leash off the face? There we go. Thank you. This one could go in the main. Do we have his number, Cindy? 
Taking a peek while they're offloading, sneaking okay. behind Teresa. <laughs> What's up? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Taking yeah, a it's peek. A Chunky Pug. <laughs> Tractor. Oh my goodness. I think he has a new name. <laughs> Another Pug. Woo. Oh, hi, Puggy Pug. Thank you. That's the only kind of sheep she has. Are you getting this one? Oh. No. For life. Oh, there's Cindy who adopted Tatum. We love Tatum. <laughs> Last minute add-on at the end of the day. Oh, you got the stall. Okay. Uh -huh. So these dogs all came from commercial breeding facilities in the Midwest. I saw someone was asking. Hi, Mr. Pug. Or Miss, I'm not sure. <laughs> it does. There's those faces. Look at that face. <laughs> There's somebody in there that wants out. <laughs> I know. So pretty. 
<laughs> Look at you guys. Welcome. Welcome to the pack. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think that's him that we hear. He says, get me out of here. This Weimaraner is very scared. Does not know how to walk on a leash, so that's why he's not walking on a leash. He'll learn. And Chanel's out, and Skeet's out. Can you, can you put them away? <laughs> 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 Kim's dog decided to join the party. <laughs> I like her haircut. I know, she looks good. <laughs> she looks really nice. Oh, <laughs> a little bit of a scared Steve coming up. Hey, John. Right. Look at that face. Welcome, little one. <laughs> Two of them. <laughs> yeah. Let's go see what they're doing inside while we're waiting. Here's Helen. Tell us what you're doing, Helen. <laughs> I am enjoying giving the paper work out and seeing all these crazy dogs. See, we, uh, we requested folders today, and this is what they go for. Okay. Here comes a Sheba. We have some pretty shy dogs coming out. They don't really want to come out of their crates because they don't know what's going on. But that's where you get to watch and see them grow as they're here with us. A little, little scared little Aussie. Yeah, it'll be just fine. Yeah. Jessica Bellas, thank you for donating. Just saw that. Thank you to everyone else who's donated as well. We really appreciate it. We have a lot of seniors on this group and seniors tend to come with, you know, more medical needs and issues and stuff. So we really appreciate every dollar that's donated for the dogs. <laughs> yeah, I think we rescued a seal. That's what it sounds like. <laughs> a seal or a lab, one of the two. There's another scared Aussie coming out. Oh, that's a good boy. That's a good boy. Yeah. It's the new gray. I know, Paul. That's my dog. 
Wow. Really? This is more like I'm not going to have one. I know. Are they great? They're so pretty. Well, I have the border the little color red put down, and now I have the border color yeah. lab that's old and. You do always go here. Jamie's got an Aussie. <laughs> I think two. Okay. I got one number, so the other yeah. one is easy to figure out. Awesome. Yeah. So. <laughs> I think what happened is when they came to the store, yes. they brought the wrong one. Yes. The dog. Yes. I agree. See, I only completely agree. I completely because they still agree. had orange collars on. Yes. There you go. Oh, um, no. Oh, oh my God. No. It's gorgeous. You guys, look at that cake. Oh, it's just a cool coffee. That's good. Oh. You give her a little bit, she'll usually start moving with you. I don't have to walk the last night. She, I don't think she wanted to walk through the people. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's either Flora or Elena. I don't, what number is she? 25. 25. Come on, baby. Sounds like you rescued a seal, yeah? That sounds like you rescued a seal back there. <laughs> Who's making that noise? That's a husky. That's uh, a husky. Yeah. It's a husky that sounds like a seal. Okay. Some little lookalikes. There's that face. Yeah. Welcome. Oh, Woo. Oh, what happened there, man? <laughs> going out. That's <laughs> snow. She's a hugely huge snow ball. Hi, baby girl. Coming around you. Oh, a little bit on for you, bud. Oh, I like that. Um, if we come. John. Yeah. Okay. John. John. Do you have another good one for Hopefully. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I know. I know. I Out of this as you can. Mm -hmm. Oh no, I'm gonna cry. One. Looks like she definitely needs some medical care. We take all the dogs, no matter what condition, what they need, we take them all and we care for them as best we can.
A big kid. Hi. I know it's the husky. Is it? Yeah. I know. Yeah, I know. Someone mentioned our crates, something being wrong with our crates because they're stacked. There's absolutely nothing wrong with our crates. They are stacked like that for safety to pack in tightly so they don't move around during transport. And they are secured in with bungees and that is the best and safest way for them to ride. Hey Madison. <laughs> Brian got a little, a little um, pee pee <laughs> so that one in the face. That is a risk of this job. <laughs> Thank you so much to everyone who's donating. As you can see, these dogs come in with many, many different needs, many, you know, Ill, you know, me medical needs and just emotional needs, and it just takes money. It all takes money to um, get these dogs in the best shape we can before we adopt them out. So we appreciate each and every dollar that comes in. It all really does make a difference. this time and we will be back out on the road before you know it there's always so many dogs waiting he's cute but tiny though oh my god Alex <laughs> return to zero to factory settings good job <laughs> Someone, um, let's see, Roxana is asking if we have a vet here to treat them, and we actually do. This building called the Timothy Center 
is our on-site vet clinic with several vets that work on staff with us. So they will be checked out and seen right away and start dealing with the needs that they have. Good question. These initials stand for National Mill Dog Rescue. Good question. The, yeah, number one inside. And we're getting the ones that are out of the back. There's some. The one that, the one that you were told about. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. He's in there. Oh. What's that, Jonathan? Yes, I do have a really cool shirt on. <laughs> it's Union Athletic. It's a great new company. Union Athletic, a great new company. I hear that somewhere. <laughs> Heaven feeds me, I gotta do something. Yeah, right, right, right. We're waiting for the seal. Yes, we are too. <laughs> it's the last one. Yeah. There's an Aussie. Pretty scared Aussie. Remember who was Ross's buddy before? I know, he looks like a friend of Ross. Scooter. It looks like Scooter. Yes. Martha is asking about shirts. We do have a store on Cafe Press where you can find our Who Let the Dogs Out shirts. What number was that, Joni? His name is Friend of Raw. Yes! <laughs> This is friend of Ross too. <laughs> My guess was the seal was a basset hound. <laughs> Sound like a hound. <laughs> oh yeah. So these dogs are not available for adoption just yet. Um, they do have to go through our regular intake and our medical intake process, which takes um, about a week to 10 days, typically. Um, if there are more severe medical problems, then it, it could take a little bit longer, but we ask that you do be patient. You can always put in an application and get the process started, but know that these dogs are not immediately ready to go home. <laughs> Hello, little one. <laughs> you can read more about our adoption process on our website, nmdr.org. You can read all about how to start the process and the requirements and everything. These dogs did come from um, multiple breeders. Here's this pug, Mr. Pug. Here's our 11 year old pug. <laughs> what a sweet boy. Anybody out there a senior pug lover? <laughs> Cindy, need another pug? <laughs> so precious. And yeah, and blind. We don't know yet. He hasn't been evaluated, but. Oh, here comes our seal. <laughs> our seal who is actually a husky. <laughs> Happy to be out. 
<laughs> Since I think I live here now. <laughs> he's gonna mark something eventually. Yeah, yeah he's working on it. <laughs> I think there's one or two more. <laughs> I'm sure we have some corgi lovers out there. Hey, Brian. Brian, do you know if the blind pug can go with another dog? Uh, yeah, they seem to be. Okay. Yeah, okay. it's fine. Yep, you're not going to last long here, huh? <laughs> okay. Doris, thank you for sending a check. We really, really appreciate it. She took the corgi. Scared to death. <laughs> Pretty scared husky coming out. Not our seal. <laughs> It's hard to hear with the wind. More concerned with having a camera. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> mm. Hi, Titra. <laughs> nice catch, Vern. <laughs> Did you say she's 17? Oh, that's her number. That's got it. She's got she's got cysts on her toes. Hi, Kim. Welcome on. No, they won't. What? While we're waiting, we'll say hello to all of our excellent volunteers. Hello, volunteers. <laughs> We're waiting, I think, on maybe one more. The doodle. The Timothy Center is our on-site vet clinic. Fully functional, x-rays, dental, um, where they can do severe dentals. And then, of course, the spays and neuters. Hi, Jamie. <laughs> We're waiting. <laughs> 
Looks like another storm's coming out on the prairie. Glad our team got in safely. Remember to visit our website, nmdr.org, for more information. Here's a doodle. Is that it? All right, kids. That's it. This is this is the look of success right here. A bunch of empty crates. So thank you for joining us, and we will be sharing more information about these dogs as we get it. Their stories. Um, just anything that we can learn about them. Right now, they're all brand new to all of us. So thanks for joining us.